Today marks three years since the deadly Columbia gas explosions in the Merrimack Valley. Those fires destroyed homes in Lawrence, Andover, and North Andover, and killed a young man. WBZ's Anaritis Rodriguez joins us live in studio now. And Anaritis, there was a special tribute to Lionel Rondon today. Lisa, the Rondon family has created an award in memory of the 18-year-old. Rondon was parked in a friend's driveway when the gas explosions caused a chimney to fall on top of his car. 8,000 other people were displaced from their homes and more than a hundred houses burned in this disaster. Today, the Lionel Rondon Memorial Award was given to the Lawrence Fire Department along with a donation to help with fire and explosion prevention. Rondon's sister says while they are still heartbroken about losing Lionel, they want to do good in his honor. In honor, we will try to make meaning and do, and do good, good out of something so devastating on behalf of myself and my family i would like to to say we highly appreciate our community who after three years have stuck with us with great support Columbia Gas, the company that took responsibility for the Merrimack Valley explosions, no longer operates in the state. A federal judge ordered Columbia to pay a $53 million fine and sell off its business. Eversource has since taken over. A vigil is set to begin in about 10 minutes in Lionel Rondon Square in Lawrence to honor and remember the young man's life.